Hey guys, Mitchell Coleman here again. Got daily reflections for you. Daily reflections. This is a book of reflections by Alcoholics Anonymous members for AA members. Today's reading is uh, for March 26th, 2020. This is called The Teaching is Never Over. Abandon yourself to God as you understand God. Admit your faults to Him and to your fellows. Clear away the wreckage of your past. Give freely what you find and join us. We shall be with you in the fellowship of the Spirit, and you will surely meet some of us as you trudge the road of happy destiny. May God bless you and keep you until then. And that comes from the Alcohol Alcoholics Anonymous Big Book, page 164. And it continues to read, These words put a lump in my throat each time I read them. In the beginning, it was because I felt, Oh no, the teaching is over. Now I'm on my own. It will never be this new again. Today I feel deep affection for our AA pioneers when I read this passage, realizing that it sums up all of what I believe in and strive for, and that, with God's blessing, the teaching is never over. I'm never on my own, and every day is brand new. This one strikes me in a way of, um, I, I know it's never over, and we will be learning every day just because you complete the steps even it doesn't mean it's done we could be learning something every day we can always become a better person every day we can always look back on yesterday and see what we did wrong then and we can fix that problem and I think that's a, a great thing to do because especially after you finish certain a certain step and you know you clear away that wreckage of your character defects and, and you have that clean slate again, it doesn't mean we're not going to make mistakes again because we are human and we all make mistakes and we can now stay on top of it instead of letting it build up and fester inside of ourselves. And then we'll grow um, to get resentment and we will have uh, those negative feelings about ourselves and others. So the quicker we could stay on top of it, the better. So we know it'll never be over. Life will never be what we expect it to be. It will never be perfect. We can't ever imagine anything to be perfect because it just won't be. And that's what makes life what it is. That's what makes us human. And we get to learn and have all these feelings of love and anger and, and all that. Life would not be very fun if it wasn't that way. We would be a bunch of robots and we wouldn't even know. You know, we have to have that light with the dark, the bad with the good and the ups with the downs. And sometimes I find myself thinking, things are going so good, when's it gonna go bad? And we can't even think that really, because we don't know. We don't know what's gonna happen. We could be happy and content with ourselves and we could be working on ourselves every day. And, and it's a great thing to do because life is a beautiful thing and we all will have these very, very tough times to go through. And unfortunately, we have to go through them. And it hurts, but in the end, it does end up being better and we learn through it. So don't ever think this is over. Don't ever think you're alone because none of us are alone in this journey and we all can support each other and that's what we're supposed to do. We pay it forward and we give back what was freely given to us. And I, I hope this helped everyone. I know this one is good for me today. And I continue to have that faith in your higher power and know that there's a plan a plan in, in motion that we don't quite understand. We could just continue to do the next right thing and that's all we can do. We can't expect others to be a certain way to, um, to please our situation because we can only deal with ourselves and that's, that's it. So uh, I hope this helped anyone. Um, I love you all and I hope you're all staying safe there during this time. And um, remember just one day at a time. It's always just one day at a time. For those of you still doing it, congratulations. And to those that haven't, give it a try and you'll be amazed. Thank you guys. God bless.